How much do you know about the Amazon rainforest? The truth is that, even though it's very important for the whole of humanity, few people know much about this ancient place which was formed 55 million years ago. Let me start with revealing the origin of the forest name. It was given by Francisco Orellana, a Spanish explorer who was attacked by female warrior Topoyas in the forest. He clearly saw reminiscence between this tribe and female warrior Amazons of Greek mythology and named this place the Amazon Rainforest. It's also a place where people have made really bizarre discoveries, and here are but a few of them. To find out the most bizarro of them all, make sure you stay tuned until the end. Here are 15 of the most bizarre discoveries made in the Amazon. With all that said and done, let's begin, shall we? Number 15. Giant Spiders The Amazon is home to a lot of bizarre creatures. This is but one of them. This is the Goliath Bird Eater. As you may have guessed from its name, it's a spider so huge that it can eat birds. In fact, it's the heaviest tarantula in the world. With a body length of 13 centimeters, it makes almost every other spider look tiny. Luckily for us, it's not dangerous to humans. However, if you touch its prickly hair, which it can shed when approached, it can cause irritation that can last for days. Number 14. Real Ants If you watch Tolkien's Lord of the Rings trilogy, then you surely remember huge tree-like creatures called Ents. Well, guess what? They're more real than Gandalf. While they don't look and act exactly like it was shown in the movie, they can walk. The speed of their movement is tremendously slow because these trees move due to new roots growing towards sunlight and replacing the old roots. Imagine how much time it takes them to walk one meter. These trees are known as walking palms or cachapona. If you spot them in the forest, please don't wait until you see them move. It'll take a while. Number 13. See-through frogs. You've probably seen this unique frog before on Discovery Channel or National Geographic. Now, let me tell you some more info about it so that you can be the coolest guy at the party. You know, unless there's a PS5 or, you know, drinks, and you know what I mean. Glass frogs live in the Amazon rainforest. They usually have a green color and they are famous for the transparency of their skin which makes their inner organs visible. Because of that, frog's body takes the color of the surroundings and makes it difficult for predators to see it. It wasn't made like this for our own entertainment. Nature just doesn't joke around. Number 12. The Legendary Pink Dolphin This is one of the most incredible Amazon River residents. Pink dolphins can grow larger than humans and there's an interesting legend about them which suggests that these dolphins can transform into handsome men in the evening. Disguised as men, they hypnotize and seduce young women and turn into dolphins again closer to sunrise. This is the weirdest D&D campaign I've ever seen. I don't know where this legend originated from, but looking at this dolphin, I can hardly suggest him doing anything like this. In regards to their skin color, scientists are still not sure why it's pink. They suppose that it happens due to blunt capillaries near their skin surface, so that's something. Number 11. A giant Amazonian flower. The list of giant Amazonian things continues with this giant flower, which reminds me of an alien monument rather than a flower. Calling this flower strange would be inappropriate because it's more than just strange. The name Amorphophallus titanum is a scientific name of the flower and its nickname is Corpse Flower. Now, ain't that just cute? It was named like this due to the disgusting odor which can be smelled when the flower blooms. However, that happens rarely because it blooms only a few times during its 40 year lifespan. Number 10. Plastic Eating Fungus. Pestilatiopsis microspora is an extremely important fungus because it can help us solve the global plastic pollution problem. It was found in the Amazon rainforest by a student of Yale University, Priya Anand. She examined almost 60 samples and one of them was especially significant because it could grow and survive without oxygen. It makes these fungi a powerful tool in eliminating the plastic in the oceans and other places devoid of oxygen. Research is in early stages, but scientists hope that these fungi can provide a solution to one of the biggest environmental problems of humanity. No word if they have adverse effects on humans who had too much plastic surgery done, though. Number- You know what? Actually, there's way too many interesting facts about the Amazon rainforest to hold it with numbers. So our next entry is the Boiling River. We already know that the Amazon River is the longest river in the world, but few people know that there are other rivers in the Amazon rainforest. One of them is called the Boiling River, and it has earned its name not by a coincidence. 
It is quite literally boiling, and at times the temperature can be as high as 93 degrees Celsius. The steam is rising from its servers, giving all living beings a warning that they shouldn't even think about taking a dip there. Interestingly enough, scientists haven't found out the reason of such extreme temperatures. But there is a theory that it happened because of a drilling company, which accidentally released gases from inside the earth into the river. Locals disagree, believing that it's a place of power, but whatever the reason, don't swim there. Perfect place to boil an egg or pasta, though. Our next entry is the Secret River. In addition to the famous Amazon River and the lesser known Boiling River, there is also the Hamza River in the Amazon Rainforest. It's roughly the same length and has even bigger width compared to the Amazon River, so why does nobody know about it? Well, the reason is that it's an underground river located 4 kilometers under Amazonian. And it's not a river in our traditional understanding. It's more like a wide trickle of water compared to wide sweeping waters of the Amazon River above. Although the flow of the Hamza River is only 3% of the Amazon, it's no little thing because there is a 3% discharge 46 times the River Thames. Our next entry is the Bullet Ant. There's an ant you don't want to meet and it lives in the Amazon rainforest. Again, it's the world's largest ant and unlike most other ants, it's solitary. There is no certainty in regards to the origins of the ant's name. One theory says it was named the Bullet Ant because the pain that comes from its bite can be compared to the pain from a bullet shot, and the other is that the ant is the size of a bullet. In my opinion, the former reason sounds more adequate because the pain from this ant's bite lasts for 24 hours and it's equally intensive during all of these hours. Despite all that, some local tribes actively seek them out to be used in coming-of-age ceremonies where boys wanting to be men have themselves intentionally stung by these bugs multiple times. As mentioned before, this ant's bite lasts for 24 hours, so just kind of imagine that coming-of-age ceremony. Our next entry is Beautiful and Deadly. According to National Geographic, poison dart frogs are some of the most toxic creatures on Earth. The poison of one little golden poison frog is enough to kill 10 grown men. The name of these beautiful, yet very dangerous frogs comes from the old tradition of indigenous people of Colombia to tip their blowgun darts with frogs' poison when hunting. Scientists still aren't 100% sure about the source of the frog's poison, and they assume that it comes from their diet. Poison dart frog's colors can be black, yellow, red, black, green, copper, or blue depending on individual habitats. These bright colors help them to ward off potential predators, and yet we still use them. Our next entry is the world's biggest flower. The Rafflesia is the biggest flower in the world, but its bizarreness doesn't end there. It is also a plant with no leaves, no stem, and no roots. It is one of the rarest plants in the world and on the verge of extinction. Aside from its size, it's also known for its unique bouquet, which is most often likened to a mix of dung and rotting flesh. There are at least 13 species of this flower, but two of them have already been unsighted since the Second World War and are presumed extinct, and the record-holding Rafflesia arnaldi is facing extinction. To make matters even worse, no one's ever cultivated this flower in a garden or a laboratory. Our next entry is the Jesus Lizard. These creatures are more often called basilisks rather than Jesus Lizards, but the latter suits them greatly due to their incredible ability to run on water. They use this ability when hunting to catch a meal or in the case of danger when they need to run from predators. In such situations, they open their toes, revealing a special webbing which they use to run on water. Why they're called basilisks, I don't know. As far as I know, they don't hatch from a snake's egg being incubated by a chicken. Basilisks live near lakes, ponds, and rivers, and in general, they're very interesting creatures to observe. In case you haven't seen them running on water, do so right now. This may be the funniest thing you see all day, honestly. Our next entry is Lily Rafts. As we should have well established by now, the Amazon rainforest is a place where you can find a lot of big things. First, the Goliath Bird Eater, and now the Victoria Amazonia. These water lilies are so big and robust that they can hold the weight of not just a child as you see in the photo, but an average-sized full-grown man. This plant, named after Queen Victoria of the United Kingdom, can reach 3 meters in diameter and looks astonishingly beautiful. But be careful if you decide to step on it. Its leaves have thorns which protect this unique flower from predators. And now it's time for the day's best pick. As always, this could be real or this could be fake. Let's find out the answer with the world's largest anaconda. Anacondas are already large snakes, but when this photo was posted on Facebook, it made some people think that we could have even more giant snakes hiding somewhere in the dark jungle. 
Facebook user Ramakant Kajaria posted a picture of a humongous snake in a forest and onlookers surrounding it. The viral claim along with the picture says, World's biggest snake anaconda found in Africa's Amazon River. This killed 257 human beings and around 2,325 animals. It is 134 feet long and 2,067 kilograms. Africa's Royal British Commandos took 37 days to get it killed. Alright, if you haven't figured it out, it's kind of a hoax. Not only is the photo altered, but the entire information associated with it is cooked up and far from fact. Before we move on, do me a favor. My analytics show that only about 15% of you watching are actually subscribed. Come on guys, what's up with that? Can you guys please hit the subscribe button? You guys watch my videos every day anyway, so you might as well subscribe and keep up to date with every video we put out. Our last entry is the Leaf Mimic Caddy Did. Leaf Mimic Caddy Dids have also mastered the art of skillful camouflage so that if it's sitting on a branch, it's almost impossible to differentiate it from a leaf. That's why the Leaf Mimic is in their name. What about Caddy Did? These insects have received this part of their name because of the noise they make while rubbing their legs together. It sounds exactly like Katie Did. It's also interesting that the tempo of their stridulation is conditioned by ambient temperature. In fact, you can count the number of Katie Dids to measure the temperature of the Fahrenheit scale. Think of them as living, breathing thermometers. Just don't stick them in your roast beef to check if the insides are cooked. Have you ever made any bizarre discoveries yourself? Let us know down in the comment section down below. Also, feel free to check out all the other amazing videos on this channel. As always, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Later, everybody!